Finding profitable, systematic trading strategies that make money in real time isn't easy. Today, we'll be going through a fully coded systematic strategy in the sugar futures market that's been working pretty well on new out of sample data. Today, we're going to walk through how this system works, its origin story, and of course, we'll provide the full system code so you could have this system trade for you automatically in a trading platform like TradeStation or MultiCharts. And hopefully, we can do all that in about five minutes. So let's get into it. Hi everyone, it's Dave Whitcomb from Peak Trading Research in Geneva, Switzerland. My goal is to make you a more profitable trader with commodity market insights and real systematic trading systems. That's exactly what we're gonna go through today is a real fully coded trading system for the sugar futures market that's been making good money in real time. So today we're gonna be looking at a trend following system with a breakout component. The name of the system is the Luxor system and the original code appeared in the book Trading Systems by Urban Jekyll and Emilio Tomasini. This is a fantastic book on building and testing automated trading systems. We're gonna take that Luxor code and tweak it just a tiny bit by adding some filters to adapt it better to the sugar market. So let's take a look at the full logic behind this trading system. It's written in the easy language, coding language. If you want the full code, it's in the notes below. Here is the full code logic for our Luxor trading system. Now this code might look a little bit complicated. It's 15 lines of code, but it's actually a very simple, straightforward approach. What this system is trying to do is to determine when momentum is shifting upwards or downwards, and then use a price signal to buy higher highs or sell lower lows. So the first part of our code here is simply defining our moving averages. In this case, we'll be looking at a eight bar moving average and a 35 bar moving average to say is momentum going up or down depending on how they cross over one another. And then there's also a confirmation of what price is doing. Is price popping, in which case we wanna buy, or is price dropping, in which case we want to sell. There are also two filters here for this system. So for example, this system will only go long if volume is rising and will only go short if the time is before 10 o'clock in the morning exchange time. Now, these filters are just to adapt this simple Luxor code specifically to the sugar market. And at the very end of this strategy, there is a simple stop loss of $4,500 per contract of sugar traded and a take profit of $5,000 per contract of sugar traded. Now, one of the advantages of putting this code into TradeStation is that we can see the way the system trades. Again, what the system is trying to do is if momentum is turning higher, as we can see here from back in July, and price confirms the same, the system goes long, and, if pr and momentum starts turning lower and price confirms the same, the system will sell short. And if we look at some performance statistics, we can see that the cumulative equity curve, so the cumulative profits over time, it's a nice upward sloping equity curve. This strategy has generally profited from the big swings in the sugar market. The strategies made $75,000, including slippage and commission costs with a max drawdown of about $9,000 over the past 10 years. So to wrap things up, what do I like about this trading system. First and foremost, it's a systematic trading system. We can see on a chart and we can see via profit statistics, that this generally is a pretty good approach to trading sugar. I also like that our profit statistics include slippage and commission costs, right? We've included those realistic costs of trading. This is also a pretty straightforward strategy. We can explain how the strategy works. It comes from a book that was written 20 years ago. So the strategy has stood the test of time. I also like that this this Luxor system works across a lot of different futures markets. That gives me confidence that this is a pretty robust momentum and trend following approach. Now, what I don't like about this strategy is that we just built this strategy about six months ago. We added those filters for the sugar market just recently. Even though this Luxor code has been around for 20 years, I would like to see this strategy work for six months, 12 months, 18 months, 24 months to really give me that confidence that this will continue to work in real time on out of sample data. 
This Luxor strategy on the sugar market is one of 10 strategies from our monthly peak 10 list at peakalgo.com. If you'd like the full code behind all the peak 10 strategies and access to the world's largest community built easy language strategy library, you can join our community today at peakalgo.com. And if there's ways that you would improve this Luxor system or there's other markets that you find this system works in, please let me know in the comments below. As always, hit the like and subscribe button below for more great stuff from Peak Trading Research. Thank you for your time and we'll see you real soon.